What's up, Wildfire? We made it to Friday. So let's go hard. We have for your warm up, you got a Tabata row. So you're going to get on your row. You have 20 seconds on, 10 seconds rest. You're going to be going a full eight rounds on this, right? Work through that. If you only have a dumbbell, right? You'll do sumo high pulls. Work through that variation. You don't have anything. Just get high knees for each set or jump rope, right? Once you finish that Tabata, we got a four minute AMRAP. We have 10 three second single leg glute bridge hold. Right, really getting these glutes firing. So from here, drive up, hold, two, three, back down, switch, two, three. Good? Once you finish those 10, we're getting our mid thoracic nice and loose. You're gonna get some lunge and twist. So lunge down, open up that hip flexor. This week you had a lot of work. Clean and jerk, snatch, back squat, right? So really wanna open up these hip flexors. Get this nice and open, get that nice twist. Switch, oh, get super deep, rotate through, all right? After you finish those 10, we're going to get 10 three-second Superman holds. So going here, just getting that back nice and warmed up. Arms are out. Squeeze at the top. Three, two, one. Go for 10. Then you'll roll on over, flip on over. You have 10 straight leg sit-ups. Just stretching out these hamstrings, core engaged, up, reach, Get that nice ooh, and loose. Cool. Now, let's get ready for our strength. All right, guys. So for your Friday strength, we're working deficit deadlifts, right? Normally, we go off a 45-pound plate or something about three inches from the ground. What this works is a lower extremity of your hamstrings. It helps build that lower part so our first pull is stronger, right? We're working five sets of five on this. So that... Once we have that plate, we're kind of centered right underneath it. We're going to bring that bar just above our midfoot. Now we set up a little bit deeper, right? But we're going to keep that chest nice and tall. Butt hinge is a little bit high, right? We don't have to be in a full squat. Nice from here. And then pull from those shoulders, right? Back down, up. Nice and controlled, all right? For this one, it's good to work solid weight. We don't have to get a five rep PR. Just work good movement pattern on this. Cool. Same thing with those dumbbells. If we're doing dumbbell variation, go on a plate or three inches, right? And work seven to nine reps every two minutes for eight to 10 rounds. Nice, a little bit lower. Work that good movement pattern, all right? For your body weight version, you're going to have 10 mule kicks and then 10 single leg glute bridges, right? Mule kick, right down, glute bridge, right? You want to make this more challenging, add a deck squat. Go back into the other mule kick. Switch legs, have fun with that. Cool? Every two minutes for 10 rounds. Now for your wad, short, sweet, and fast. Cool? For time, you have 50 calories on the rower, all right? Just go hard, have a rower right here. So we got 50 calories for time, right? Now we're working this, we're working strong pulls, right? You feel this, look at this extension. This extension is almost like a deficit deadlift. I'm overextending, keep my heels planted. I pull back, drive right through, right? Strong pulls are better than super fast pulls. Keep your cadence the same in your calories per hour. You'll knock this out two minutes or less, all right? If you don't have a rower, your variation with a barbell or a dumbbell will be 50 sumo deadlift high pulls for time. Keep that chest tall, pull right through for 50, all right? Body weight version, you're going in, 800 meter run, knock it out. Cool? Enjoy your Friday workout. Until next time, see you then.